Hello YouTube and welcome back to Old Flads. Now in the last episode we had the car chase which was pretty scary although we managed to escape. No casualties so that's all good. And now we have something a little bit different. This is the main airfield for the entire map. It's the northern airfield. And we're going there. Now I know already from what I can see in the side chat that this place is just a free-for-all so I'm going to be shooting everyone and everything because if I don't they'll just shoot me and that's never any good for me and it's not really good for our series either considering the distance it is back up here I swear when I find a map from the bottom of the map it must be the best part it must be all of the 10k because it took an eternity to drive up here and I ran most of it but I wasn't I wasn't exactly at the bottom of the map when we started a few videos ago but we're going to move a bit closer there is so much stuff here this is huge this airfield absolutely massive so we're going to get a bit closer see if we can find a vantage point and then see how we're going to attack this so this is the air base there are a few zombies dotted about. They're because of me, almost certainly. I am beginning to wish, however, I approach this from a different angle. Because... This is, this is like the most obvious way possible to come into the airfield. But if there was anyone else here, I, I would essentially be a sitting duck. Uh... It's not ideal, I must admit, but I would quite like, I do need a map, I really do need a map, and morphine, am I going to find morphine, I probably will find morphine in there, which is, it, it's just going to be vital, there's so much stony ground, if we can get up here, maybe we'll have a better vantage point, does that go to the roof, I think it probably does, Okay, so we're going to go up to the roof, which, to be perfectly honest, is probably where someone else is going to be. The lack of zombies, though, indicates that I'm probably alone, which pleases me, because I could really do without any interference at this point. Oh, wow. Sniper point much? I think it would be better up there if I was just looking to kill people than it actually would be here because well you're not exactly a difficult shot from someone over there and that is not a long way away that's three three hundred meters away not very far at all I could do with some night vision though could really do with some night vision I think we're gonna have to go down there it's just how I'm gonna go down there the question. Okay, I've decided that in my infinite brilliance, I'm just going to go through the front door. I'm relying on the basis that no one would actually be this stupid. And, hopefully, it will come to my aid. It might backfire horribly, as I, I could well imagine that happening. Because, well... That tends to happen to me. But we're here now, so we might as well just get on with it. I hear bodies. I might expect. Aggro zombies. How wonderful. One body there. Doesn't look like he had much. Oh my god, there's bodies everywhere. And why did I come in here? Oh man, I'm I'm the dumbest person I know. This I have killed so many people that have been up in these towers. It would quite obviously have been a good idea not to come here. I'm gonna have to go down the sodding ladder as well. This is the zombies. Oh, you idiot. 
Why did you come here? Oh man. I should this is the single worst place to run. Oh, I don't want to shoot him. Okay, fine. Gotta hope I can get out the front door. No, oh, I managed to get out the front door. Okay, that's fine. Am I really gonna run across the airfield? Oh my god, it looks like it. No, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. I've come too far. Where is the second body? There's one. What I'm looking for is seriously tooled up people. These barracks are tiny little things. These are supposed to be these are high value barracks, but I don't think in all honesty. Wow, that's there's a lot of people in there. Three people with an ice pack. Find his gear. Blood bags, no, EpiPen, no, morphine injector, yes. That is what we wanted. Got anything else? No, he's got a hatchet, I could really have done with that. Get out of the door. Get out of the goddamn door. That was nearly a very, very big disaster. I need to get back in here. I need this guy's, yeah, this guy's hatchet. Why has no one got a map? God damn. He's got a map. Perfect. Right, we're off. That was all I really wanted. We got the map. Oh, this stupid bloody door. Why would they make these doors so small? I think I'm probably a bit too fat. Oh, no, we're out. Right, okay, that's what we came for, and we're off. To the trees! Right, now, this is good, because now I can give you little overviews of where I've been on the map. That's going to be part of the new series as well. I just had to get a map in order to instigate the whole thing. But basically what I want to do is just show you my trip around so that you know where I've been. Frankie-esque, if you like. But anyway, thank you very much for watching. This has been a successful raid on the Northern Air Base. I think I'm going to stay up here for a little bit. I really want to try and uh, find some night vision goggles. And I think I'm only going to find them on players, to be honest. They're going to be rare as rocking horse shit. But anyway, thank you very much for watching and I shall see you next time. Cheers, bye-bye.